Hi, this is Kat Parquet, President of the Junior League of Portland, and I'm excited to announce the recent award of two grants from our endowment fund to some very special community partners. The first is a $1,000 award to Rose Haven. They're a women's only day shelter that's providing some essential services to women and children during the hours that other facilities are not available. They actually are seeing 75 to 90 women on a daily basis. It's an incredible program and the gift that we're making is going to be matched by a grant from the Maybell Clark McDonald Fund um, for a total of $2,000. On May 10th, they are hosting the Raining Roses Walk, and so we hope that uh, you, will, you will join us in um, getting out and getting some activity and supporting this amazing organization and their great cause. They're helping meet some really urgent needs. Another organization that's filling a huge gap in our community is SARC. This is the Sexual Assault Resource Center, and they have a unique program designed to fill the gap, um, really bridge the gap for women, girls who are getting out of the life of sex trafficking, who once they turn 18, a lot of services are no longer available to them. So that's a huge issue in our community where the journey to recovery and truly being out of the life and able to stand on their own two feet um, is a very long one. So sometimes you have girls who may have been recruited into sex trafficking when they were as young as 12 years old, but they turn 18, they still need help. They still need resources and classes and support to um, function as adults and really thrive in adult life. So the RISE program, it's called the Resilient Survivors Empowerment Program. I love that. They are filling that important gap and it's really one of the, the only program of its kind in our community. So we learned that they had an urgent need to help provide transportation for these women so that they can actually access those services and the programs. So we have made a grant in the amount of $2,500 to help them fill that need and they're gonna work to get that matched for a total of 5,000 and that should cover public transportation expenses for, two part or for five participants for an entire year. So if you have an opportunity to look at SARC and their RISE program, I would encourage you to consider matching our gift and supporting their efforts. And also take time to learn more about the issue of human trafficking and what the survivors of this horrible issue in our community, what they need um, and what we can do to help them in their recovery. So thank you to Rose Haven and Stark for bringing these needs to our attention. And we're so glad to be part of their incredible work. Thank you. Bye.